Welcome to State of Tech. Here's an iPhone 6 tip for you. I'm gonna show you how to use Spotlight Search. Now from any one of my home screens, all I have to do is swipe down and I enable Spotlight. What this allows me to do is search my phone for music, notes, apps, messages, contacts, photos, movies, no matter what's on my device, and also it does some Safari searching for different results as well. So for example, I know that there's a new Terminator movie coming out and I want to get some show times. All I would have to do is start typing in Terminator. Notice I've got movies in theaters, I've got Wikipedia, I've got news, and even as you saw the different options as I was typing, it showed some contacts, it showed some applications, and here I'm even seeing results from Bing, and then I can search Wikipedia down at the bottom. Now let's say I was looking for Starbucks. I wanted to get my mobile order in. So I'll tap on Starbucks. Notice that I start typing. I've got top hits would be Starbucks. I have music, videos, notes, messages. So you see there's a bunch of different things that it's actually searching on my device. And what's really great is I can do this from any home screen. So I've got a few home screens right now. And if I can swipe over, I can go to any home screen, swipe down, and then there's my spotlight search. Now notice it pulled in my recent search, but it's already highlighted everything. So if I wanted to type in something right now, it wouldn't be that difficult to just start typing in. So it doesn't really need to remember what I was searching for last. It just makes it convenient that whenever I swipe down, if I did a recent search, it's automatically highlighted that field so I can just begin typing. So that is how you use spotlight search on your iPhone. For more iPhone tips, be sure and visit State of Tech dot net